Hello, hello everyone, and welcome to Silverhawks Let's Play. You haven't seen this ship before? Well, you have if you if you've seen the ship before. Um, yeah. Anywho, I'm picking up quests. I'm running level one missions right now, and uh, yeah. Eliminate pirate causing this nuisance. The reason why I contact you is because my, cause my effective standing with the secondary um, level 2 agents is getting to an end. So I basically run through all of them that I can do myself. Well, uh, that I can do myself. I've basically run through all the missions until the level two one starts. Um, reload all. I don't need to turn that on, but I did anyway, anyhow. Um, teaching myself, I'm doing Heavy Missile 5, because then I'm going to do Heavy Missile Specialization. Um, and together I raised enough money to buy this ship. And uh, yeah, that's what's going on, basically. And I also bought all these... Drive kind active. of well armor and stuff the thing is I'm using a large large shield extender and I'm doing a EM field amplifier and a combat kinetic shield hardener <coughs> The difference is, is that you might want to have one that X. Okay, let's turn you on. Let's target you and fire. 36 and 38 and these goes 36. So let's go a bit closer before we fire. <coughs> These are Kaldarin Navy Scourge missiles, so they cost like shit tons. And this is estimated to be 4,150k, the ones that we got here only. So yeah, they cost a lot, but they're worth it, in my opinion. Let's do like that. You can have an extra. Okay, you can't have an extra. Okay, you can't have an extra either. Okay, so I'm done. Well then, that was the first mis mission. I'm close to Yita. So, yeah. Uh, jump through that. Warp drive active. Warp drive active. Those will be the loyalty points I get. I got this amount of them right now. I could buy stuff for from my Kaldori Navy girl, but nah, nah. And as I said, this got two days left on it, so that's kind of a um, jeebus. Okay, so yeah. It's, it was my phone 
in which I use for work that was making that sound there. Uh, dock. Warp drive active. Yeah, I like this place. It's a nice place to pick up missions. I also got the secondary objective here. And uh, then the third is not very far away either. Docking permission requested. This Docking I did earlier today. Accepting. I killed something to get this killing spree thing. I think it gave me three hours of view mission. Complete mission. Okay. How about now? Nope. Still 0 0.9. Okay. Let's pick another mission then. <clears throat> the following objectives must be completed to finish the mission. Drop off location. Pick up aim then return them to your agent. Right. Oh. Ships restriction. You may use your caracal. That is nice. Set destination. Undock. <clears throat> Since these are level, level 1 missions, I usually don't have any, like, I don't have to jump 40 different Board zones. To accept them once I accept them, a moment and these are ordinary heavy missile launchers. I could actually upgrade them as well, but I haven't haven't even thought about that because. My money has been kind of a tight because these mission they pay they just don't pay shit tons and at the same time let's see warp location they don't they don't pay shit tons and I use a lot of the money to buy these missiles. I could probably make these missiles myself. But yeah, I haven't started on that yet. That's usually what I do once I get a little bit better missions. Like for now, if I go and grab everything here that these gives they don't give any extra <coughs> they don't give shit tons of uh, money okay i could do that or i could just push one to f1 f2 f3 if i wanted to but i'm too cool for that Right, oh. Now I pushed F1. Mm -hmm. Mercenary fighter seems to be holding on pretty hard. Take my other missile as well. Now he's gone. <coughs> Let's ride into this field. Warp drive active. 
And yes, I'm just using uh, kinetic ones. Caldor Navy Scourge Heavy Missiles. This is what it looks like. Aha! I'm mainly joking. I I rather not play in this kind of view. It's a tactical view. Some people love playing tactical views. I I don't see the point. I rather play in first person view. Yeah, um, might as well shoot the third one. Hmm, I probably lost my drones somewhere because I had drones before. I have a tendency to drive out, out of the field with them. Still attached. No, I meant... <laughs> God damn it, can't I talk? I usually drive out, out of the fields with them still in the field. That's probably what happened this time around as well. Okay. Use all my power to kill you then. That's the cargo. Pick it up. That's probably the aim robot. Sister of Eve Bunker. That's the aim. Let's find our parameter. Jump through. Warp drive active. It's a lot of um, right arrows here, etc. I have a right arrow on my main account. I, uh, when I played at the most, I actually had it up. I used it to teach myself the blueprints of uh, heavy missiles and stuff. And I processed and worked with them so they became a lot better. But uh, later I took that down, which my guild leader did not like very much. He thinks I should play this game m more often and harder, etc. I tend to agree with him. I should. But there's so many things that I should be playing right now, so that's why it takes from me what I'm playing.
Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Let's see if I get promoted now. New mission, complete mission. Not yet. Not yet. Okay then, let's take another mission, shall we? Uh, these are blood raiders. Destroy convoy and return with cargo. You may use your cargo. Accept that. One dock. Jump through Stargate. Warp drive active. Warp drive active. Uh, I love playing with the Kaldari. Because I love the Kaldari ships. Reload all. And I love playing with missiles. have a peek at the ships here. Ships tree. This this is my dream. I love the Drake. I think I drove level four missions with it. No level three missions. I drove the drake through. Uh -huh. Warp to location. Blood Raiders. Blood drive active. And yeah, there's a very nice site that you can go to and read about the missions that you're taking and on that site you also see what kind of uh, resistances they have and what kind of damage they do etc. You can use that to your advantage like you could drive with something else than kinetic shield hardener for example if you wanted to harden it against active. that kind but what I've noticed is that most of them do kinetic damage <clears throat> shot one shot towards it uh, I might disconnect you and take you instead since these things don't seem to be attacking me And that one will be the one we circle around. Might as well reload you. Thirty-six. Pew 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 pew. Fire 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 fire. That's the next one that will feel my wrath. Oh, 
Okay, so they're all happy campers now. Let's be in with you then. Okay. If you want to die that fast, then sure. That's the one. Pew pew pew. I'm gonna change the background a bit. Blood-rated personal transport probably have the most of the things that I want. The 10 militants on it. they're doing they're doing non-kinetic to me aren't they yes they're not shooting me with kinetic so yeah that's a problem this one is also no that one is working that's once uh, em Which would be the thing they're using. those out and then take that out Yeah, you see there's not much in it. This one is 14k, so it's almost no value in salvaging these. I thought he'd <clears throat> well he did leave that god damn it so the last one I really don't need to shoot <clears throat> but let's anyhow since it's worth 25k isk in bounty That what it was his death. I 
think these will give me more militants. A module has run out of charges. A module has run out of charges. Yeah. <clears throat> Anywho, set destination. Why don't you and run for it? Warp drive active. We're not going to shoot anything more now, but we might as well reload these so we have them for the next mission. Warp drive active. I wonder what these are. Right. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Might as well pick th those up. Yeah. Hello there. And complete mission. Damn it. He still needs some more convincing. Um, okay, let's take this third last one then, since it's the beginning of five. Investigate the call, eliminate all hostiles in Marosia. Sounds like a plan. We can also check the loyalty point store. And then go for heavy let's actually had heavy in the title three thousand loyalty points you need I got one thousand something something um hum um dock i thought i'd uh, finish this quest and gain level two missions didn't think i'd have to run several of them Walk drive active. but apparently i did All hostiles. Uh, warp location. Warp drive active. I know one of your stupid newbies would fall for this. Now send me all your isk or I'll pod you. Shouldn't you like do that after I warped in? One lone pirate. Two K isk 
is you worth? He died pretty fast. Let's drive up to that loot and check it out. You're going to win medals one day. Never mind. Warp drive active. Warp drive active. Talk at your place. Warp drive active. And please hope for me to finish this now. Might as well reload all, even though I only took one of each. This that you see a number two on is actually two of these. <coughs> so in total I got five. Accepted. Complete mission. Damn you! Four point five. Uh, right. Anywho, this is about the amount of missions I'm going to run with you today. I'm going to run a few more with you tomorrow. So I'll catch you then. Have a nice day. Make sure you like and subscribe and all that jazz. And bye bye.